Hello coders, I welcome you all. In this video, we are going to discuss how to upload large data set faster in MySQL Workbench using Python and SQL Alchemy library. I am recording this video because I have been getting a lot of queries about why it takes so long time to upload data sets to MySQL Workbench, especially in this particular video, data analytics using MySQL. So let's get started. First of all, what is SQL Alchemy? SQL Alchemy is an open source Python library that provides a set of tools and abstractions for working with relational databases. SQL Alchemy allows you to create, modify and query databases using Python classes and methods. Let's create database first. As you can see here, currently I am using MySQL Workbench. Let me click on this. So as you can see, MySQL is running on local host with IP 127.0.0.1 and port number 3306. Username root in my case. Password that I have given ABCD123. I am showing this all because these informations will be required in our code. Let me press this button. Okay. As you can see over here. So now let's create one database first. So let me right click on this and create schema. You can give any name. Let me give data underscore my SQL. You can give any other name as well. Let me press this button apply. Let me press this button apply once again. As you can see here SQL script was successfully applied to the database. Let me press this finish button. As you can see here our database is successfully created with this name data underscore my SQL. So we are going to load our data set into this particular database data underscore MySQL. So let's jump to Jupyter Notebook. As you can see here is our code. As you can see here I have imported this module warnings and set it to ignore by using warnings dot filter warnings to ignore all warning messages during code execution. As you can see here I have imported create underscore engine function from SQL Alchemy library. This function is commonly used to create a database connection engine when working with databases using SQL Alchemy library in Python. Here I have imported pandas SPD that help us to load our data set as pandas data frame and as you can see here create underscore engine. So this line of code creates a database connection engine using the SQL Alchemy library. It connects a SQL database located at this particular address in our case local host means our database available locally on this port number 3306 using the username root and this is password in my case and here database name is data underscore my SQL that just we have created this one data underscore my SQL. So this create underscore engine function is used to establish this connection and prepare the engine for interacting with specified database this one. As you can see we have created instance of this with this name engine. You can use any other name as well. Now engine dot connect. So this line establishes a connection to the MySQL database using the database engine that we have created over here. Just I have created one instance of this and here PD which is pointing over here to pandas library read underscore CSV. So this line reads data from a CSV file named salaries.csv and stores it in a pandas data frame named data. So this is our pandas data frame where we are storing our data set with named salaries.csv. So as you can see this line takes the pandas data frame this one data and writes its contents to MySQL database table named test one. So this table will be created in our database here. Table will be created over here in our database that just we have created data underscore my SQL and this is connection engine that we have created over here. As you can see here our next parameter index is equal to false. It specifies that the data frames index should not be included in the database table and this is our last parameter if underscore exist and that we have set to replace in place of replace we can also use append it specifies if the table test one already exists means if this table already exists it will be replaced with the new data from the data frame this one because here we have set if underscore exist to replace as I said in place of replace we can use append so data should be appended 
to the existing table if already exist and finally we are closing the connection let me execute this code as you can see done let's jump to my sql workbench and let me press this button refresh as you can see over here we have successfully created our table test one in our database data underscore my sql that you can see over here table name which is created over here let me click on this icon as you can see here our data set so this way we can upload large data set faster to mysql workbench using python and sql alchemy library that you can see over here so this code is given in the description of this video hope you like this video please don't forget to subscribe this channel if you like this video smash that like button thank you very much for watching this video take care bye bye see you in the next video